How is everyone feeling this fine afternoon? Comment below and let me know. And for those of you who don't know, this channel is called No Trash Tolerated because we don't tolerate no trash, okay? If you don't have bars or a decent message or some kind of a, a some form of quality artistry, I don't want to hear it and I'm probably going to talk some trash about it. Now, it's been a long time coming. I'm back. I've got the setup. We're ready to go. Uh, if you like the video, hit subscribe, hit like, hit hit all on the, you know, hit that little bell button. Um, yeah, time is the most valuable of currencies, so let's get right into it. I know you're gonna dig this. Oh, yeah. Perfect. I hope so. Yo, yo, yo. Okay, yo. Yo, I like you. You're like a tiger. Yes, I grew up on a door in a single parent family. Been through a little bit of tragedy. Yes, I was around drugs and violence before the day that I started secondary. That's part of it, not half of it. Get the picture, the rest ain't necessary. Growing up, got a little caught up. That ain't even half of my life. Also, given the knowledge of self, that is all we actually need to survive. If you saw uh. me, age nine, reading Malcolm, just fine. Teachers don't uh. treat me stupid. Students that couldn't speak English, they put me in groups with. The irony is, some of the first man to give me schooling, you were called gangsters. I already explained that we know what the truth is. They used to say, don't be like me man i'm glad you guys recommended this right away i can already tell man we'll, we'll just keep going it's it's a uh nine minute video so we'll just keep going man i appreciate this i can already tell man he's he comes from the struggle and dude he's putting his words together very carefully and he's executing yeah, I got a name and don't on the street. Nighttime comes, I can't sleep. It's the part that rappers don't speak. We don't hit the road because we're thugs. Don't come out the room, want to sell drugs. If we got the right guidance and love, would we fight people just like us? How can uh. I not hustle to get by? How do you think I ate as a child? Judge no one, done many things wrong. Just don't vote. Man, he's saying so. Dude, I mean, diet. How we're raised. If we have more love, you know, people who took care of us, man. It's, it's all in the upbringing, you know? We all know it. We all know it's all in the upbringing, but man, already just just coming coming with truth man i love it R right away too he's not wasting any time how can i knock the hustle to get by how do you think i ate as a child judge no one done many things wrong just don't boast about it in songs but listen to my older bars i was just as confused as you probably are but you grow when you learn travel one cut one too many man you know get caught one too many man that could have been doctors end up spending the whole life boxed up you learn uh, if you stop, oh, you just man dudes that could have been doctors spending their whole life boxed up yeah Man, it's it's crazy the kind of potential we can waste if we don't don't have it's not, it's not just the upbringing. After your upbringing, you got to do something with it. You know what I mean? Regardless of of how how messed up your life is, you got to do something at some point for yourself, but I I get it. I mean, so much wasted potential. Um doctors that are just, you know, could have been doctors but they're locked up. Love it, man. Any man that could have been doctors end up spending the whole life boxed up. You learn if you study, so set out just to make them money. No mm. cover. It's all about getting poor people to fight with one another. So it's not cool that us killing our brothers. Ooh. This in our mothers is right in line with the dominant philosophy of our time. But time is a cycle, not a line. Coming back around, you regain your mind. You be ready for the energy. I oh, my man. You guys got are there interviews with him? Like, is there you guys got to recommend some some more stuff by him? I know I'm going to be doing part two, three and four. And I already have the Daily Duppy on the channel, but man, you, you can tell the guy's got wisdom. You can already t already tell. The feet of our time, but time is a cycle, not a line. Coming back around, you regain your mind. You be ready for the energy I challenge in my rhyme. Remedy the pedigree, the jeopardy of your mind. When the world's this f left it is a crime. We can all fight uh. when the brothers over crumbs. Harder to fight the one who makes guns. We can all talk, get two dollars. Harder to be the one who seeks knowledge. If we understood economics with no money's nothing, think nothing of it. Money is a means to get wealth. Not the wealth itself, and don't get confused. Uh. Far from broke, all that you see me do, I own, but I won't hang what I make around my neck. I know from where that the diamonds came, but I do literally own a library that definitely costs more than your chain and businesses and property Fourth hang on hang on money. hang on sierra leone he knows where the diamonds come from man he, kn he knows those are blood diamonds come on hang on here hang on we got to go back because it, it, if i stop paying attention for four seconds i just i i, I just miss like two bars i just miss like a, a whole a whole paragraph of knowledge you know what i mean just by not just by missing four seconds all right here we go here we go oh do you see me do i own but i won't hang what i make around my neck i know from where that the diamonds came but i do literally own a library that definitely also hanging around the neck like like uh that i think that might be a reference to slavery as well like 
I mean, Kanye even even has a line about, uh, you know, like something about like, you know, we, we now we buy our own chains, you know, to like kind of say consumerism is a, a kind of a form of slavery was his creative way of putting it. But hey. Cost more than your chain and businesses and property far from starving. I eat quite properly and I don't care. Just said it for the kids. You need to know you're not broke to listen. Don't know what asset from a liability. They've never been shown nor told the difference. So they don't change situation. Richest man in Britain is Asian. That's significant. Not coincidence. Asian people build businesses not by flossing, going out shopping. Hey, come on, bro. If you guys get mad at me pausing this, I don't care, man. I'm sorry. You're going to have to go watch watch someone who doesn't, doesn't value this stuff because... Man, there's too much good stuff in here. It ain't never been shown or told the difference, so they don't change situation. Richest man in Britain is Asian, that's significant. Not coincidence, Asian people build businesses, not by flossing, going out shopping, giving up the culture for everyone's profit. Who runs Bollywood? Indian people. Who runs our ish? So we shake our ass <laughs> and dance as if racism just up and vanished. But has it? No, it's right on course. You're beating so bad to train to ignore. Let me not just make stupid oh, statements. Man. I'll explain it. For small amounts of drug possession, there's more black people in jail in America. The net is for rape and arm robbery. And murder all put together. You can say oh. they're just fucking up drugs. Imagine every middle class kid that had ever held drugs. Man, dude. Oh, oh. man, this is good stuff, man. Oh. I I don't even I, I can't even really dissect it all. There's too much in there, but I mean he's he's speaking nothing but truth. Nothing but truth in this. Um he's obviously educated, he obviously understands the systems in place you know he he uh man dude akala akala does he have albums does he have singles let me know Oh, that's right, that'd be your kids bigger than that. What is going on with this prison in America's private business? To get paid 50k per year per inmate by the state. Just wait. Also, oh. they are allowed to use their prison inmates as slaves, cheap slave labor, big corporations that come out of jail when they can't get a job. So when we celebrate going to jail, we are literally celebrating enslavement. Add to that that the hood that you live in. Bro, the the private indus uh private prison industry complex pays our politicians. Um it's crazy the 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 prison industry which takes people who commit crimes pays under the table american politicians who write the laws that that get people in trouble now i'm not i'm not if you're committing crimes man that's you know that's one thing but there there's a a heavily established system the private uh private prison industry complex you would think they're government ran they're private companies man these are not government. I mean, they get government money, but the tie between prisons and uh, and um, politicians is. I mean, the politicians should be in the prisons, if you ask me. Just saying, man, it's it's insane. But man, this yeah yeah, all right. Engineered social condition to breed crime by design. Where do you think you get your? I bro, I can't, I can't. Yeah, he just keeps he keeps coming with it. I'm blaming Akala for this. The reason I'm pausing it, it's Akala. It's his fault, not mine. But hey, man. Uh, and then the cult. He goes in the cultural. Oh, dude, I, I'm just gonna have to shut up and listen. That you live in engineered social condition that breeds crime by design. Where do you think you get your? And you could say that they're just black, but I like to deal with facts. In the 1920s, you would have found in America black towns, prosperous centers of economics to education to make you proud. But some people couldn't bear that the former slaves would not just slide down to the KKK and other hate groups. Burn those towns to the ground, killing uh. hundreds if it ain't understood. You think you were always living in the hood? It's only been 60 years since the hung blacks and burn them, and that was so cool. They were your baskets, picnic baskets, even gave kids the day off school. Go see a lynching, have a picnic. It's fun to watch the little monkeys die, and people act a little dysfunctional. Mm. You wanna pretend that you don't know why? If your color means you can be killed, and you're powerless to get justice about it, is it difficult to figure out how you would then end up feeling about it? And that ain't excuses, just dealing with the roots of abuses that make a reality where a generation of young men speak of ourselves as dirt casually. That's America. This Britain, something similar, some different in this country. Hang on, before he gets into Britain, man, like I I'm gonna make sure I'm recording first of all. Okay, we're recording, we're good. Man, I mean, he, he talks about the culture of it, he, he talks about uh. Man, I, I my head's spinning. I gotta go back to nine excuses, just dealing with the roots of abuses that make a reality. Where... Oh, Lyndon Johnson's Great Society in the 1960s. Um, after Kennedy got shot, um, Johnson came in and he rolled out these biggest the the biggest social programs. The facts are, 
the 1920s, like he's talking about, the 1920s, 30s, and 40s, um, and the 50s. Um, I, between 1920 and 1940, um, were, were, I mean, fact check me on this, but they were the most prosperous time for black Americans uh, financially. I mean, there was so much growth. Uh, uh, it was, it was phenomenal. It was astounding. The, the amount of growth uh, in the black community in a 20 year span was, was the most growth in uh, a population, one of the largest growths in a population in such a short time in history. Not the most, but I believe it's one of the most prosperous times. And then you have social programs uh, rolled out. And uh, you have these things that say, I mean, there was somebody who said, uh, um, it was a, a, a guy I was listening to, but he was alive in the 60s when they rolled out these programs. They came, knocked on your door and said, hey, uh, you could you would qualify for these social programs, uh, but not if there's a man in the house. If there's a man in the house, I mean, it's it's to me, it seems blatant and, and man, it's incredibly corrupt and dangerous. And you see literacy rates, you see see financial uh, literacy. I mean, I mean, you see all these demographics, uh, single motherhood, uh, all these diff demographics changed after the 1960s when these programs got rolled out, man. Hey, the, the, this dude's this dude's the real deal right here, man. This dude's the real deal. Akala, hell yeah. Worst conditions, most tax, look where you live and yet you go to the pub Friday night you will fight with a guy, don't know what for, won't fight with a guy Shooting a titan, you send your kids to die in a war They don't send the kids to the rich to the politicians, it's your kids The poor British, but they're saying to go and die in a foreign land For these wars that you don't understand Yeah they say you are British, and that lovely patriotism they feed you But mm. in reality you have more in common with immigrants than with your leaders, I know Both sides of my family, black and white, a fed ghetto mentality, reality in this system Poor people are dirt regardless of shade But with that said, let's not pretend that everything is the same. When our grandparents came here to Britain, if you had a criminal record, you couldn't get in. That ain't protecting for all of the stupid, stupid abuses they were living. Kicked in the teeth, stabbed in the street, many times firebombed our houses, put feces through our letterbox, and of course the cops did so much about it. Mm. Days up to the 80s, people spitting on my palm because I was a goof baby. But of course, that has had no Damn. effect on why today we are crazy. And yep. this was for any good reason. They were just dark and grieving to ease the guilt now for all of this treatment, constant stereotypes and needed. So if I celebrate how big the bitch that I'm flipping, clips that I'm sticking, chicks that I'm hitting, I'm playing my position. But if I teach a kid to be a mathematician, messing with the schism, how they're gonna fill a prison when materialism oh, is not what I believe. Man, if if he if he talks about how big his dick is and, and the chains, the jewelry, and, and you know how much of a thug he is, he's playing his position. But if he teaches a kid to be a mathematician, he's breaking the schism. Man. Yeah, it's true, man. I, I said in one of my videos, I, I was pretty adamant about it, but I said, F your race. I'm trying not to cuss as much. I got people I got to be responsible for, kids, man. You got you to gotta watch your mouth. But um, I said, F your race. And, you know, I, I mean, we've got in Britain, I don't know what it's like, um, but I know in the U.S., we still have racial problems today. I, 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 no system's ever going to be perfect, period. Um. You know, but comparatively, I think we're in a better place today than we've ever been. Um, but he said in the 80s, you know, he, he, someone spit on him in the 80s because he's mixed race, basically. It's what, it, that's, that's what I caught. Man, it's real, man. You know, I, I, I've got friends who aren't white, and they tell me things, man. I, I know... I know uh, it never happens when I'm around them, oddly enough. And when we're in public, it never happens then, but... You know they they uh man it's it's a real thing you know but ultimately it's it's ignorant people and you got to confront it when it happens or just live your life you know what i mean if you spent time getting angry about everything you'd never get anything done so yeah, man. All right, let's keep going. In my position, but if I teach a kid to be a mathematician, messing with the schism, how they gonna fill a prison when materialism is no longer our religion? What do you think we got now in Britain? Just like America, private prison, prison for profit. That mean when your kids go jail, people make money off it. So keep environments that breed crime, build more jails at the same time, market badness to the kids in the rhymes. Long as rich kids ain't dying, it's fine. Get them to the point where some are so lost. That you believe if they don't celebrate killing themselves off. 
Mm. And it's because they're soft. Was Malcolm soft? Was Marley soft? Tell me, was Marcus Garvey soft? Well, was Muhammad Ali soft? Nah, nah, I think not. But they want us to think that the road is cool. Being on board is all we could do. We don't control the whole cell production. So who benefits from us moving the food? Or thinking there's no way out of old life. But Malcolm X used to hustle on the roadside. And Marcus Garvey organized more than six million people with no Facebook or Twitter. Why is it something you can't eat? One of my oh, the man. Man, we have the best medium in in all of history right now to connect and organize people. How is it that we're the most disorganized and most disconnected from each other that we've ever been? Marcus Garvey organized six million. I didn't know that, but he, he obviously did it without uh without Facebook, Twitter, without any of that. How come we can't do that? It's not that we can't. But you have to think hard about uh, you have to approach it methodically and strategically. But, you know, I, I don't I don't know exactly what he's what he's trying to say philosophically deeper there. But I, I don't know exactly what he's trying to say. But I, I get what he's saying. And, and I agree, man. How come we can't do it now? That's insanity. Insanity. Facebook or Twitter, why is it something you can't eat? Ish. One of my own homeboys did a 10 straight in the boxing yard. Now what's he doing? Passing his doctorate. Don't tell me that it's too hard. Who trained you Ooh. to believe inferior? Your son won't ever do in Nigeria. Are the remains of an ancient moat dug 1,000 years ago? 20 meters wide, 70 down. Round the remains of an ancient town that's 400 square miles around. 400 square miles around. Please, please don't believe me. It was a documentary on BBC, but we ain't studying <laughs> history. Too busy watching MTV. And MTV said, we're platinum. Now everybody want to go and wear platinum and MTV said pop magnums now everybody want to go and pop magnum if MTV uh, said drink juice you can start hearing that in tune soon hey today you're warm my car yeah is it now more important what I got to say oh when I drive a Mercedes by the way so everybody listen to what I got to say <laughs> does that make you all happy ah oh, but she, it's my head still nappy think for myself so some mad at me but on the mic check not one batters me all of this here is good for the rhymes put us in the same place at the same time and it's clear to everybody I'm out of my mind some of these guys are running out of their rhymes clear to everybody those has got ears I'm the guy that they just might fear that they want to get near but they can't have a peer all day. I'm hard looking. You just like beer. Front on the kid for another five years. Come Man, his a bit. He, like all, all the all the the social messages that the the history f philosophy lessons aside, this guy can rap. Man, this guy can rap. I I mean, just the, the his ability to go rapid fire. The the oh man, Whew. this guy's skilled. You know what I mean? To my shows and some criteria mean that much to him. It's a movement. I don't speak for myself, but a unit. Black, white, man, woman. Anyone who respects truth, we put in. Dudes are like no dinner, we're just putting. Yeah, you're sweet, but no substance pudding. You can never ever be with a level on. All songs get played out, never living. Yeah, you're sweet with no substance pudding. There's no nutritional value to pudding, man. You're sweet, but you got no substance. You're gonna let him talk to you like that, Stormzy? Come on, bro. Pudding. Yeah, you're sweet, but no substance put in. You can never ever be with a level on all sorts. Or no substance put in. Damn, dude. No, okay, I got it, man. Damn, it's even deeper than I thought it was. <sighs> no substance pudding. No substance put in. Oh, come on, bro. No substance put into your in your art, man. That's not art, then. There's got to be something there. Dudes are like no dinner, we're just putting. Yeah, you're sweet, but no substance pudding. You can never ever be with a level on. All songs get played out, never living. We speak for the people properly, not for the old fat guys in offices and the girls laughing. Ain't fair, you can't even be bothered to comb his hair. Anyway, that's enough kissing my own ass. Back to the more important <laughs> task of being so shower. I got half the hood screaming, knowledge is power. And I ain't saying that'll change that, that. But I do know this for a fact. Right now, there's a you on your block with his hands on his face screwed up. So he don't Ooh. care, don't give up. That he won't let nobody call his bluff, but the words go in. Open your shack covers once that's happened. There is no going back. Or would you start to see what is really happening? Who the enemy you should be attacking is. So read, read, read. Stuck on the block. Read, read. Sitting in yeah. the Yeah. Read, read. Don't let them say what you can achieve. Because when people are enslaved, one of the first things they do is stop them reading. Because it is well understood that intelligent people will take their freedom. Because if we knew our power, we would understand we can't be held down. If we knew our power, we would not mm -hmm. elevate not one of these clowns. If we knew our power, we wouldn't get arrogant. Damn when straight. Two pennies. If we knew our power, we would see what everybody sees that would rich already whenever my nmc's go run for your mummy i'm hungry i run for my tummy that's enough back to worshiping money i'm off back to the study oh is that it man i didn't want it to bro yeah that's right charlie sloth man dude so much in there i mean read educate yourself man i i mean 
whatever circumstances you come from, man, just because you come from a circumstance, learn how to read, read books, read philosophy, read history. If you're educated, you can't be sold a lie if you know the facts, period. Man, you guys, okay, I'll be doing the, the fire in the booth part two, three, and four. I Like I said, I had the daily duppy. Um that I that I reacted to already man oh my god dude I could talk I could talk for days I could talk for days about everything he said man but man where where is this dude today like what is what is he up to is he is he a professor now I mean I I know he had some kind of a what was it, like an honorary degree I I saw there was a video of a lecture man but but man yeah, he's, you could tell, I would love to talk to this guy, but hey, whew, you guys did me right with this one. You guys did me, a lot of people recommended this, so I, I appreciate that. Um, yeah, more to come soon. Appreciate it.